Hello, hello, peeps. Janine here, your favorite holistic jersey girl. So I just want to come live because I've been doing a lot of talking to other people about over 40, right? So I am 46 years old. Um, I got LASIK in 2008-ish. So it's been a while. And I see that when I go out to dinner now... <laughs> Like, I'll just use this for an example. I'm just, I used to be able to see, for, like, I, I don't know. I mean, I guess you wouldn't really have a, a menu this close. But I just noticed that sometimes I have to, like, bring it out a little more. And I'm like, yeah, I'm not doing the readers. Like, who's with me? Like, <laughs> if you don't want to use readers either, drop me. I mean, or drop a one. That is, like, my number one thing. I'm not doing the readers. So I was researching it because amongst readers there's a couple other things that i've noticed that i'm like eh. i feel like this is it's a midlife thing and other women must be going through it if they're going through perimenopause menopause pms whatever it is the second thing other than your vision like seeing blurry up close is acne like i was developing acne at an older age i never had acne in my life and then as i was getting older i was getting these huge craters on my chin huge and so i'd use this skincare on it it would dry it out make it really red and crusty like who who's with who has the zits here the hormonal zits drop a two let me know who my hormonal acne peeps are let me know let me know also i mean aging like no everyone goes through great lengths whether it's like botox fillers i don't do any of that stuff um just all types of skincare, all types of crazy th things that they do because they don't want the lines here. They don't want the crow's feet here. They don't want the laugh lines here. You, you feel here. You know, like it's what women struggle with is self-confidence as we get older. I mean, I can, I can vouch for that. If that's you, drop a four. I think we're up to number four now. Drop four if you su suffer with self-confidence. Because the thing is, all right, as we get older, do I, so I'm going to be wearing readers. I'm going to have acne on my face. And I'm going to be like experiencing, what was the third thing I said? I said self-confidence with the acne, anti-aging. Yes. So I wanted to give you a few different things because I don't personally want to go and like squint. I don't want to wear the readers. Absolutely not. Not doing it. Not doing it. So I was researching. I'm like, there has to be a way for us to improve or prevent this from happening. And there is. And so I use I use a drink. I mean, this is the drink I use for the acne um, and for anti-aging because I feel like I'm not doing any of the crazy stuff. Like I'm not do I don't want to do the treat. I don't want to do the peels. I'm not paying like thousands of dollars. I'm not doing fillers. I'm not doing all that anti-aging stuff. I want to do it naturally. I know our bodies are meant to heal and be our best friends in everything we want if we treat it right. So I think that we just need to treat it right. So for the eye exercises, right? I'm going to give you an exercise here. There's four different exercises. I'm not going to go through all four, obviously. I'm not going to keep you. But I'm going to tell you one brief exercise. And I'm going to walk you through it. And then for the acne and for the anti-aging, I use this drink. So if you want, if you're interested in that, just drop drink and I'll hook you up with that information. If you want all of the eye exercises, I ha I'm going to be doing it in my group because I feel like maybe not everyone wants to see for eye exercises. Maybe they do. I don't know. Maybe I'll go live and do it. I'll have to see how it goes. But anyway, if you're catching the live, drop hey. Let me know where you're tuning in from. If you're new here to the Janine Show, drop new so we can connect. And if you're catching the replay, I know on TikTok you don't do replays. But here on Facebook, if you are watching the replay, hashtag replay. Again, let me know where you're tuning in from so I can see how far these videos reach. So, okay. We're going to close your eyes so you can make note of this or, or do it with me. You close your eyes and you're going to circle your eyes clockwise 10 to 15 rotations. So you close your eyes 10 to 15 rotations to the right. Then you're going to rest and then you're going to obviously close your eyes again and then rotate counterclockwise for 10 to 15 rotations. Now the re and then rest. And the reason why this is good is because it trains your eye muscles. It also improves your blood circulation, which improves your vision. So if you love the idea of that, drop me. I have four eye exercises. Drop me uh, four so I know that you want the eye exercises and I'll hook you up with that. Um, so, I mean, that's the thing. This is what I really wanted to cover. 
um, with acne, with your appearance, with readers. I don't know about you, but as, like I said, as I'm getting older, I've made a couple um, um, a couple changes. Like right now I'm drinking Duncan. It is decaf, okay? And so I know a lot of times people, when they get older, they get upset, right? They think, oh, I'm getting older. I can't do the things I used to do. No, it doesn't matter what age you are at any point of time in your life. There are things that you have to do and make decisions what feels good, right? So now I wear comfortable shoes and I really don't care because I know that wearing heels or like really big platforms are uncomfortable and I'm gonna be in pain and not happy. And right, and I don't, I don't wanna look like frumpy, but the thing is you wanna be comfortable so that you're happy. And when you live from that place from the inside, when you're happy from the inside, it, it comes out. And so this whole thing about aging and your age has nothing to do about, has nothing to do with it. It's about treating your body right, I always say, if I eat bad, then I feel bad. So if we treat our body right and we do the right things, like we could do these eye exercises to help or to strengthen our vision, who wouldn't want that? I don't want to do the, who's with me who doesn't want to do the readers? I don't want to do the readers. I don't want to squint. I don't want to not be able to see when I'm driving. I don't want any of those things. So if we could do simple exercises to strengthen your eyes, increase the circulation, improve your vision, I mean, who's with me? Drop me yes if you're with me. And again, with the aging, I, I, I don't feel or look my age. I don't want to, I'm not doing any of the fillers, but I do the anti-aging from the inside out. I also use, yeah, I mean, I use eye cream and all that, but like, honestly, it's just a matter of drinking something. It ha This helps with clearing your skin. It helps with anti-aging from the inside out. So if you work on these things from the inside and the outside, you're going to feel better and you'll, you'll get out of that slump of that I'm middle age, I'm getting older, I can't do this, that, and the other thing. So if this rings some bells, drop me some bells below. If you got some value, if you know other people who are suffering with menopause, maybe not being able to see clearly, maybe some issues with their skin, whether that's aging or acne, please share it out so it could help someone else. And thank you for listening.